Hello again and welcome back to Mario. This is the castle island that I've been working on. And as you can see, not a lot has been added. I, I put one of the quick travel spots up here and added this back wall here a little bit with the stairs going up to what's going to be the next level of the town. And I worked on this. I think I, the last time you saw this, I think I had the roof a little bit taller maybe. I'm trying to remember, and I didn't have this back part. Basically, this building's done. Uh, the interiors are mostly finished, and so you can kind of see what I did on this end and the back. So it's got like little balconies and stuff. I had to just take some my own liberties because I don't know how the backs looked in the picture that I was copying and then uh, I'll go inside and show you around. So first off, uh, left side is kind of like, the, what I'm thinking this building is going to be is like the uh, guild hall, like we would come here to get like quests or something. So this would be like their research library and it's got this little tranquil fountain at the end and then you go up here and more stuff of books and then this direction gets you down into the lower area of the tower and this takes you back down just another stairway another way to get up here back down to the entrance this goes out the back not you know much to it over here we're having lovely texture issues again I don't know why it's doing that on this computer all the time. At work, it looks fine on that computer. It's probably a setting I need to turn off here or something. But uh, anyway, so I wasn't sure what to make this room. It, it could be like a kitchen, I suppose, or maybe just like a, maybe it would be like a lounge, I guess, where you like put some couches or something in here. If you guys have any ideas, let me know like what kind of things you would see in the, like a guild hall. And so we'll go back up to the next level. And so up here is kind of just the, like a little landing, I guess. I've got like some benches back there. I guess you could use them as benches. And back here again. So off this direction, I was thinking of making this like the dining hall, but then I would want a kitchen. And so I wasn't sure if this would be a good kitchen, which seems kind of strange because it's sort of a transition landing area or if going up this way and making that the kitchen. But I, I think the other one would be better because there's not a lot going on. Uh, this, I've got two benches under here and this is the back balcony. And then on the front, we've got another balcony that's a little less, uh, a little less area that you can actually see what's, what's happening out there because it's just enclosed more. And then you can continue up. And then now we're on like a intermediate level here where it's basically just a balcony that lets you look into the barracks or over on this side, a balcony that lets you look into what I'm talking might be the dining room. Uh, it just occurred to me you have not seen the barracks yet, so I'll go down here. They are up here. It's kind of a interesting layout. So this is just a bunch of beds and then foot lockers for each bed and I don't believe there's anything in any of them so at the moment uh, I may add stuff to them later on I don't know depends on what this gets used for but and then across from it we just have a banner because there's no no upper level up there so but yeah back up to the top here so I go up and like I said this just goes around and it's got like a balcony so you can look down into that room that may be like where the actual guild type process goes. And then this looks to be just more attic, like a storage area, I think. So I'd probably put some chests and boxes in here. This would maybe be like where they store all the items that you found on your quests or things like that. So that's really all I've gotten done. I'm, I apologize for taking so long to put on another video, but I've just, I've been busy at work. I've been busy at home. I just really haven't had time. Um, of a lot of life happening <laughs> so I just don't really have time to do videos oh there is another thing I can show you though so this is like I said that other part but what 
I've been busy with down in here. And it's nothing spectacular, but I've kind of hollowed this out. And this is probably going to be really hard to see. Let me see if I've got brightness up all the way so you can see it. And I realize it's hard. Let's see if we go day. Oops, not tie. Time. There we go. I don't think that really helps much. <laughs> uh, so anyway, this is just kind of the the bowels of the the place. It's actually pretty hard for me to see what's in here too. I mean, like the the water is uh, pretty bad. Let me see. Let's put some temporary stuff. So you can kind of get a, a feel for what's in here. So it's basically just water, and then the ceiling is like arched. And it just goes on and on and on. And apparently it gets really dark. And so I plan on continuing in that back in a ways, and then having like a stairway to get you up. There used to be a way to get up through here. That was weird. Well, like spike. There used to be a way to get up here uh, in behind, which I don't think I've shown you that either. So I'll show you that real quick, and then I think I'm going to wrap this video up. Kind of a short one, I know, but uh, let's see. Not a good way to get back there. Just fly around here. So you can now get inside these little like towery things. Can't really see anything. Uh, I may lower the window one so you can, and then I made it look like the back side of these doors. This will be kind of like an interior of the town where like storage and stuff for whatnot. And this did go down um, into those catacombs down below, and I, I didn't really like the way it looked, and it just kind of dropped into the ceiling, so it kind of sucked. But uh, I'll probably have a way back in there where you can get here. And it may be like more along this side because you can't really get down there either. So you can I break that? Yeah. So this takes you down. I don't know if this would be a good way or not, but it's ideas. So yeah, that's what I've got so far. I hope you like it. And um, I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.